Even so, I think we can both agree this isn't something we can ignore. Between what we learned at AMS and the journal we recovered from Harper's Ferry, this is big. If this is the source of the super mutant threat, I'm prepared to support any action to end it. Initiate. Good timing. I can't believe he just walked in here. He must have been at work even then. You should see if anyone needs help with anything. The arrogance he must have had to come here. Knowing what he was doing. Unbelievable. The question facing us now is how to find him and the people who've been taken. Lucky for us, Scribe Valdez has made a discovery of her own while we were away. That's right. Remember the Pip-Boy you found in the Uncanny Caverns? It took a while to crack the encryption, but I've unlocked it. It came from Vault 96. I can't wait to tell Max about my latest patrol. He is gonna love it. Well, we're not sure it is. What we do know is that we have a definitive lead to follow. The super mutant threat takes priority. If we find the missing civilians in the process, so much the better. But we cannot ignore this lead either way. Unsurprisingly, Night Shin and I don't see eye to eye on this. Fortunately, in this case, we don't have to. I think they're connected. A vault would be a great place to hide abductees. The Pip Boy might even have come from someone that escaped. Investigating the vault is our best lead for either mystery, and maybe an answer to both. Then we're agreed. The vault will be your next target. Scribe Valdez will accompany you. A vault is a potential trove of exactly the kind of technology the Brotherhood is meant to catalog and secure. I've marked Vault 96 on your map. We don't know what we're walking into, or even how we'll get in, to be honest. We'll need to be cautious. Step one is finding a way in. You'll take point. Based on other vaults we found crossing the country, the vault should have an emergency transponder. Once you've secured the entrance, the controls for the transponder are usually there near the main door. Activate it to give the all clear and I'll follow you in. I'm glad to hear it. It's a good plan, and I think we're all in agreement on this one. Find any evidence you can about the missing people and any connection to the super mutants. If Blackburn is there, I want him taken alive. If he really is behind the abductions, he needs to answer for his crimes. You have your orders, Initiate. Good luck. Dismissed. Missed. Little late to the party, aren't you? If you're looking to loot the place, some blood eagles are ahead of you in line. I'd stop you, but uh, I think I quit. Our squad was guarding the entrance here when we were overrun by blood eagles. It killed everyone. <laughs> uh, me too. I just haven't kicked it yet. Yeah, raider types, but more bloodthirsty, you know? You can usually deal with the crater sort. Blood eagles, though, <laughs> they enjoy the killing. Name's Woods. Corporal Woods, Hellcat Company. Mercenaries. We got hired by this creep of a doctor to guard the place, among other things. Promised us salvage rights here when he was done. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna collect on that. <sighs> A 
Love the optimism, but ugh, my ticket's punch. I think I can go easy, knowing someone's gonna take out those blood eagles. Make better choices than I did. Wow, it's freezing in here. Look at all this ice. The environmental controls must be damaged. What happened here? Those are Hellcat Company uniforms, right? It looks like a massacre. Well, that's gonna complicate things. If the Hellcats were here already, then Blackburn, the abductions, and the super mutants are all tied together somehow. Give me a moment to look at these terminals. Ooh, that's not good. The vault's on internal lockdown. I guess someone's responding to the Blood Eagle attack. If there are automated defenses still working, they'll all be active. We may be facing more than just Blood Eagles. Be careful. Let's get moving. I'll follow your lead. Locked. Must be the security lockdown. Let me try something. I was able to use the Pit Boys protocols to get the doors open, but it fried the circuits. If we run into any more locked doors, we're gonna need another way through. I should be the boss. I really should. I guess we found Dr. Blackburn. Looks like most of this place is locked off. We need to search everywhere, but our options are limited right now. 
I think that door labeled mainframe is stuck open, though. Let's start there. This vault was a biological research facility originally. Lots of small tumor genes. Lots of tumor genes. Perhaps it is fitting that I found this place. I have been honest about my purpose, after a fashion, but less than forthcoming about its nature. One. I'm gonna rip you out of that armor limb by limb. one. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn, number 22. In retrospect, my enthusiasm for the cryogenically preserved specimens in the vault was excessive, if not actually misplaced. I am down to the last four viable test subjects. Further research is at an impasse unless I move to human subjects. Obtaining volunteers will be impossible. The necessary experimentation to even approach a functional result will be unavoidably fatal to some. I will have to take extreme measures to obtain subjects. Thousands, perhaps millions of lives will be saved. Utility trumps sentimentality and law. Feel it. Something's close.
Identify intruder detected. <laughs> Persistent refusal to depart is a distraction I do not need. Please, I am asking you again. Leave this place and do not return. There is nothing for you here but sorrow. Whatever you think you will accomplish here, I promise you that you will not. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn, number 38. The capture of human test subjects is itself less difficult than I imagined. The people of Appalachia are in bad need of medicine, and lone travelers are easy to approach when one has a doctor. I tell myself these acts are necessary, the work too important, and I cannot complete it without living human subjects to experiment upon. It is I compound failure upon failure. In my quiet hours, I questioned what I have made of myself in pursuit of this goal. I began this enterprise fully cognizant of what it might take. But even with that foreknowledge, I could not comprehend the weight of it. Have I become no different from that fool, Elias? A font of monsters with no humane end in sight? Am I deluded in believing myself capable of success? These moments pass. I push aside those doubts and focus on the work before me. The people of Appalachia need this. The world needs this. Let them vilify me when they learn what I have done. I will make a better future for them, even if I do not live to see it myself. And law. citizens will not be harmed. Oh. Glad that's over with. Why would he electrocute and irradiate his specimens? What was he hoping to learn? This seems insane. You bet. 
Asher? Who do you think it is, jackass? It's Tally. Hold up. You're not one of mine. You sound familiar, though. Oh, you're the one I talked to back at Fort Atlas. You know her? Listen, we're in a bad way here. Cut off from the rest of our people and the damn robots keep coming in waves. We need help. I can fix that, but you gotta agree to help first. I can make it worth your while. I've been trying to get us out of here since we've been locked in. I just found this vault security key card. Should open all the doors in this place. You help us, and it's yours. Nothing. Same as stopping you from shooting us if we let you in. We don't need more trouble. We just want to get out of here. Help us hold off the bots and we'll leave peacefully. For you, anyway. No promises if someone else tries to stop us. Now we're talking. Now give me a sec to get the door open. Good thing Shin's not here. I don't think he'd agree to this. No shooting, boys. They're on our side. Oh, crap, here they come again. showed up when you did. Looks like I was right about you. Shame we keep meeting under these circumstances. We could get into some real trouble. Can't believe the Brotherhood bailed us out. Well, a deal's a deal. Right. Key card's yours. I get a bigger share, right? Yeah, banged up, but with the coast clear, we should be able to get out of here. I, ain't even shit I don't say this a lot, but... Thanks. I can't believe we just got thanked by a blood eagle. All yours. You got this far, so I'm guessing the way you came is clear. Thanks again. Maybe we won't even shoot you if we see you again. No promises. You got interesting friends, Initiate. Search log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn, number 57. I begin to doubt my own sanity at times. My efforts, while not without progress, continue to fail to bear real fruit. The FEV seems almost deliberately malignant, as if it had a consciousness 
and rejects my every attempt to bend it toward a benevolent end. I have come to recognize the signs of imminent metastasis and conversion to the so-called super-mutant state. I am ill-equipped to deal with the product of such failure and have taken to disposing of these unfortunates outside the vault itself. I regret that my current methods of disposal may, in the short term, increase the super-mutant population in Appalachia, but it cannot be avoided. End law. These vessels were once filled with specimens, stocked here so that the captive scientists could turn them into perversions of nature. Like West Tech, they concerned themselves only with whether they could do these things, not what benefit they might bring. At best, they made weapons. Such a pointless waste. I have turned what they left behind to better ends. We're supposed to bring him in alive. Don't forget that. No matter what we've seen here. Research log, Dr. Edgar Blackburn. Number 112. My work's demand for human subjects has increased dramatically as I make ground toward my ultimate goal. To this end, I have contracted with a group of mercenaries calling themselves the Hellcat Company. Trustworthy such a term applies here. They display a useful moral flexibility. They do not question the nature of my work or my need for human subjects. And I do not illuminate them. Already they have begun acquiring new subjects at a far greater pace than I could. And a contingent remained to guard the vault itself. I must be careful. A mercenary is only as loyal as their pay after all. My control of the vault security systems keeps them in check. For now, and long. There ain't nothing good out here. Uh, nothing nowhere. It's all shit. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
creators of the forced evolutionary virus were idiot savant. They saw weapons, soldiers, to win a war that would end almost as soon as it began. They had discovered a means by which we could seize the reins of human evolution, and all they could envision was more efficient death. My colleagues at West Tech were likewise fools. They made the virus a plaything in Huntersville, their ant farm, shaking it to watch them scurry. The FEV was never meant to create abominations. At its core is something wondrous and hopeful. I will free it from what they made of it. Humanity will have the future it should have had. And a better human will build that world. Free from fear and law. die in here. You're not with those others, are you? Can you get us out of here? Uh, not exactly. I think the locks are controlled remotely. The doctor guy always does something back behind the stairs there, before he comes back to grab one of us for his tests. Is he coming back? Okay. I was gonna go for a walk, but I guess I'll stay here for now. Sorry. Seriously, this? though. Thank you. I feel sick. Help us. Oh, thank God. You've got my thanks, stranger. Introductions are in order, I guess. My name's Cassie. Did I say that already? Somebody get us out of here. Now that sounds like a fun bunch. Uncle Art mentioned them in, uh, broad terms. Can't say I'm not glad to meet you, though. Help us? Yeah, that's me. You know Uncle Art? God, he's got me so worried. He might even express an emotion besides world weary. <sighs> I hope he's all right. I'm not injured. Got lucky. The doc didn't do any surgery on me. That nut job was dosing me with diseases, though. Said he was. Testing incubation and immune anymore. response times. <sighs> Weird thing is, he kept apologizing. Got a bad case of sludge lung now. <clears throat> but I'm... <clears throat> I'm holding up. <clears throat> Some of the others are in worse shape. Back? We ain't going anywhere. Hey, if you run into that crazy doctor, give him a kick for me, all right? I just want to forget about all this. Give Blackburn a kick from me. Please, don't let him take me again.
ask one final time. Leave this vault and the things you have seen. You cannot change what has happened here. Leave me to this cold and lonely place. The card doesn't work? Blackbird must have overridden the door codes. Probably guess the looters might find a key card eventually if they had the run of the place. From here? If I had more tools, time, and some schematics, sure. Under the circumstances, we'll have to get creative. These doors are hydraulically sealed. If we can find the lines that feed to this door, we might be able to cut the pressure holding it shut. Look for a utility room nearby. This should be it. Take a look. See if you could find the lines to the overseer's office. That'll drop the pressure, all right. Okay, the door should be open. Let's go. It appears neither the vault defenses nor the Blood Eagles were a match for you. Quite formidable. You can lower your weapons. It would clearly be futile for me to struggle, and I surrender willingly. Yes, I assumed as much when you entered. Very well. Consider me arrested, if you must. I am ready to face any judgment the Brotherhood wishes to mete out. My work here is complete, regardless. And it is too late for you to stop it. Simply that I have achieved my goal. The FEV is perfected. And it is too late for you to change that. My sacrifices. The terrible things I have done to accomplish this. It has been paid in full. And now salvation awaits humanity. What? You can't do anything with it now. We've caught you. You're finished. Have I given you any reason to believe I have not already taken the necessary action? Okay, that's not good. I have completed it. I turned a flawed miscreation into something that will heal an ill and wounded humanity. But if by that you mean, what have I done with the result? It is no longer here. I have... Associates. They are even now finalizing the mechanisms of its distribution. You are too late. Paladin Romani needs to hear about this immediately. I am at your disposal, then. You can head out. I'll radio for a team to secure the site and get the prisoners to safety. Then bring Blackburn back to the fort. I'm sure the others are going to have a lot of questions for him. Good work, Initiate. I'm glad you were here. Think of me what you will. It will change nothing.